डाबर चमन प्राश प्रो रेस्लिंग लीग सीजन चार कोपावर डायमल के आज पंद्रह दिन देवी सचनों मुकाबला है स्तुति पंजाब रॉयल्स और यूपी दंगल के बीच शुरू करते हैं आज का पहला मुकाबला और ये मुकाबला है मेंस 125 यानी के 125 किलोग्राम वर्ग कुश्ती मुकाबला स्तुति पंजाब रॉयल्स की ओर से आ रहे हैं कनाडा मूल के कोरी जार्वे लीग सीजन चार खोपावट पायामल में देवी सचनो पुरुषों के एक सौ पच्चीस किलोग्राम वर्ग कुश्ती मुकाबले के लिए यूपी दंगल की ओर से आ रहे हैं कतर मूल के जॉर्जी स्कैंडलीज There we have Corey Jarvis standing at 125 kilograms coming in from Canada gold medalist at the Commonwealth Games in 2014 Taking on the gigantic Georgie Sakandalitse from Qatar silver medalist at the Asian Championship in 2018 at the age of 28 in the 125 kilograms category Ladies and gentlemen welcome to the Dabachon Prash Pro Wrestling League season 4 co-powered by Amul this is your host Sarthak and we are about to commence bout 1 of day 15 and I'm joined by Mr Andrew Cook in the com box hello Andrew how you doing Sarthak wow right away georgie looking for an arm spin getting the fireworks started right away wow right awesome. away yes. they're all out You know, I think he understands this thing. Um get a score early and 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 hold his lead. He's done that in all of his matches so far. The last match he actually poured it on a little bit. But he's got a big big face here with with Jarvis. Absolutely. Cory Jarvis is looking to consolidate on Punjab's win. They're already through to the semi-finals. So they don't have as much pressure as the UP Dungles have on them. No doubt about it. No doubt about it. New action. UP Dungle win today. They're through to the semi-finals. So this is a much needed a do or die for the UP Dungles. Yeah, so it goes to show uh, they must have been talking to to Georgie out there and saying, "Hey, let's get this thing started off fast." Obviously, getting the thing rolling first match is a big deal. You know that's our tough. Absolutely. You know how fast bouts help the entire momentum shift either way. No. Absolutely. Action. Action. The 125 kg category bout come coming up right here the biggest bout of the day and usually we've seen that the heavyweight bouts have been blocked andrew but today they couldn't be blocked yeah you know um there's a bunch of good heavyweights and and having uh, having that block actually does a big big service to your team sometimes uh Sometimes the blocks are the difference makers in these duels. So what we're seeing is a lot of underhooks from both these wrestlers, Andrew. Yeah, absolutely. What what they're doing is they're pummeling. They're going back and forth, Red doing a hand side. fight, um, which is it was is called a pummel as well. So they're looking for uh, right there. You can see, and this is a this is a, a passivity warning now on Corey Jarvis. No one really looking for a takedown. They're more on the. You know, look just, out for each other's moves, you know. You know, yeah, absolutely. Jarvis went fast and hard right away. Now, see, this is the yeah. second no passivity they called it in really a quick time. And we got a 30 second shot clock. That's on for activity clock. That's on for Corey Jarvis right now. As we head into the final 50 seconds of round number 
neither player opening the account as yet. They're using all their strength. You can see the, the you can see the exhaust. They're feeling exhausted. You know, it's um, a long couple weeks where every day there's a match, and if you're not wrestling a match, you're getting practice in and just. Activity time expired, and Georgie takes the lead one to nothing. So you peek the board right away, and that's a big deal to start this thing off. Very big deal, Upi. Considering then it's a do or die, they need every point, and every point, every bout one will count in the ultimate countdown. Absolutely. Okay, good first round. Real good first round. Yeah, again, Georgie's looking for... He's looking for the leg, looking for the takedown. Yeah, he wants to get scoring on the board early in these rounds. Both, both rounds, he started off with an attack. You know, it's so important for That's them to keep a certain distance from each other, fearing that they could be taken down. They are keeping that gap between each other. Yeah, absolutely. Absolutely. And you saw right there, they, they pushed off, That's and now it. they're in a what's forehead-to-forehead forehead position here. And um, just like that, we're only 30 Yo. seconds into round number one, and Georgie's got himself on the activity clock. One of them is going to break loose in the final two minutes. They'll have to. I think they'll have to. What do you think, Andrew? Yeah, it's gonna. It's Georgie's gonna be the one that's gonna have to score here, because in 30 seconds he's gonna be down one to one. The score is gonna be tied on the board, but he's gonna be the he's gonna be the first one to score, not the last one. Jarvis will be the last one to score. So Punjab is gonna have a lead if if Georgie doesn't get a score. And we're looking like it's about to tick down. Georgie needs a point here. As we head into the final two minutes of round two and the first bout. Can Georgie do something here? Jarvis knows right here. Jarvis knows if he holds strong and holds good That's position and defends well, he's going to take a win there for his team. There we have it. It's one each. Action, do it. Well, I see. Wow. Okay. So this is All really right. good for Georgie. He's looking right for here. a push out. Looking for a push out. Oh! oh. And Jarvis with a push out. Point. Jarvis getting the push out. So we're going into the final minute here, and we got a two to one lead for Corey Jarvis. Georgie really needs to get a point here. He was just about, he was just about to score, uh, or at least put um, Corey on the activity clock. But Corey turned it around. Stuti Punjab Royals coming in with a lot of confidence, considering that big win over Haryana Hammers in the last encounter. Oh, absolutely. Look at Georgie's. Put him on the, in the zone. That yellow part of the mat is called the zone. And Georgie's looking. Oh, 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 oh my God. That's a big down. Looks like 125 paddle, kilograms on both the nothing. sides. There we see Bajrang Punya getting warmed up. 35 seconds to go, and they're going to go. They're going to call this a grounded attack. That they were both on their knees when this thing went out of bounds. This is huge. 125 kilograms on either side. Absolutely. Jarvis still holding this lead. 20 oh, seconds to go. Georgie knows he's got he's got a score here. 15. Georgie needs a point here as we head into the final eight seconds of this bout. Looking for a gut wrench and a roll. Oh, Georgie did it. Georgie did it. I think it's two points for Blue at the buzzer. At the bar, two points for, holy smokes. So that's a challenge now, challenged by Jorvis, by Punjab. They want to see this thing replayed and they want to put it to the jury. A challenge here. This will be very interesting. At the end of the bout, we're seeing a challenge thrown in. 
And this score happened right at the very end, and we'll see what happens here. He went for the leg. You see Georgie's going in for the single. Corey's looking for a hip toss. Uh, uh, wow. We don't have a clock on it. There is definitely two points there for Bob. I don't know what the clock says. We'll see right now what this jury brings up. As it stands right now, Georgie Scandalizi from UP Dangle is gonna take the win at three to two, and it happened, it stands. UP Dangle seal it at the end. And he will earn one more point to make it four to two because of the loss of the challenge. What a comeback. Wow, there what a you match. can see Corey Jarvis extremely disappointed. He lost it at the extremely last few seconds turned the entire bout around. UP Dunkel supporters jubilant here. Let's go.